I'm Dion, and on my channel, we're gonna talk about fashion, lifestyle, marriage, and relationship. But today is a special day because it is Dion's top 10 list of the things that men want. If you wanna find out those top 10 things that men want, hang out with me, and hit the like, hit the notification bell, and also subscribe to get the latest and greatest Dion content. And watch the rest of the video all the way to the end because every item on this list is a perfect gift for just about every man right now. The first thing that I wanna say before I get into my list, it is not in any particular order. It's not based on price range or anything. I'm just going through the list of the things that I think that men want. And again, I'm a man, so I want these things as well, hint, hint. So just keep that in mind. So as I go through the list, we're gonna have things from different price ranges. So whatever your situation is, of course, we don't wanna go in debt during the holidays. We wanna be um, fiscally responsible during this time period. So shop within your means. You don't wanna come January 1st or January 15th, you get that bill and like, oh my gosh, I went too far. And now you gotta spend the next five years paying off Christmas presents that you bought five years ago. Don't do it. So I got a wide range list. So let's get it started. The first thing that's on the list, um, I gotta talk about coats. Y'all probably seen my video in reference to the different coats that men want. One of the things I didn't have on that list as far as coats, um, of course you want a nice winter coat, that's very, very important. But one thing you also have to factor in because lately in Georgia, it's been raining all the time. So you want to have probably some type of a trench coat or something like that. Now, for people that are familiar with the traditional trench coat, it's a lot of buttons and straps and belts and all of that. At Banana Republic, they have a beltless trench coat man. It is comfortable, it looks good. I have it on right now. Um, I love it. And the price point is amazing. They have it in a light brown like this one right here. And I also have it in a darker brown as well. So check out Banana Republic. They have an awesome selection of these types of jackets from ranging from size small all the way up to a extra large. So check that out. That is an awesome gift. But also, don't forget about the coat. One of coats of your significant other, the man in your life, doesn't have a nice winter coat, check out my video, Express versus Zara. They have some amazing coats, so check that out. So one of the first things on the list is a coat. The next thing on my list, I think is a staple for any man. You want to have a nice watch. Now, most of the time when you see me, I have on a watch even in the video. And matter of fact, this is the watch that you've probably seen multiple times, right? You've probably seen this watch multiple times in my video. I love this watch. It's a Movado watch. It's comfortable. It's silver and gold. Love it. This is something that I wear all the time because most of the time my accessories have silver or gold in it. Now, I do have a all silver Movado watch as well. So when I have on all the silver accessories and different things like that, and there's no gold on, then I go with that one. Um, also, if I'm going to do a little bit more business casual, I might go with a um, my Movado watch that have like a black band, it's very sleek. It goes well with suits and different things like that. The last thing you want is a big bulky watch when it comes to, 
you know, um, going with business casual, things of that nature. So I like a watch. So depending on what type of watch your man currently has, think about another watch that could fit well within his accessory um, drawer, okay? The next thing that I have on the list is still on the line of watches. And I think this watch is more important than the mobile watch. The other watch is a smartwatch, okay? So you definitely want to have some type of smartwatch. Mine is Apple, but of course they have Android smartwatches as well, Samsung. The smartwatch is the way to go. When it comes to overall security, um, so nowadays a lot of people are stealing people's wallets and purses and things like that. And you have all of your credit cards and things like that in your purse. If you have about four credit cards, it's gonna take a while to call all of these different places and cancel all of your credit cards before they use them. If they steal your purse, to be honest with you, you don't necessarily have to have any credit cards in your wallet at all. You can put everything on the watch and no one can access the cards that's already preloaded or that you loaded on your watch. So it's just an additional security measure that you can take advantage of. Now, does every establishment have some type of Apple Pay or uh, Google Pay or something like that? Not every establishment, but most. So this is a great way to, you know, keep your credit cards and things like that secure. But also it's perfect for your general overall health. It tracks your uh, heartbeat. It tracks your uh, steps. So this is just another way that you can continue on your journey, of, you know, weight loss and things like that. If that's something that you're uh, interested in, but also just general health. So it even have fall detection. So, you know, they had this thing uh, a long time ago, you probably remember, I've fallen and I can't get up. Well, yeah, that, that's kind of what this does. So if you fall, um, it, it detects, and like I said, it can call the authority if, you know, you, you don't actually get up or whatever, right? So this is something that's really, really, really beneficial. So smart watches are essential. Now, they also have kind of like a hybrid where, so like right now I have like an athletic band on there, but you can switch these bands out to silver, gold, change the faceplate, things like that. So you can turn your smart watch into a very stylish watch as well. So depending on what type of watch your man currently have or the male in your life currently have, then accessorize that existing watch that they already talked about the coat we also talked about the watch another great thing to purchase for men it is winter time it's fall time and every winter every fall it is time to pull out the boots so if your man does not have a pair of good boots please go out and get him some boots now boots I don't care what kind of boots they are. Men like all types of boots. Construction boots, combat boots. Now, with those type of boots, that's very specific. However, the boot that I think that will probably work out really well is a nice chucker boot. Every man can take advantage of a nice chucker boot. It goes with jeans, it goes with chinos, it's perfect. Also, you can throw in maybe a Chelsea boot or something like that as well. So these are the types of boots I think that people will really enjoy and get a lot of wear of. So you know that you're gonna definitely uh, have a present that they're going to wear and enjoy. So no more ties, no more ties. Boots. All right, the next thing that's on the list. Now, I'm gonna tell you, with this one right here, I would probably go to say, uh, just about any grown person over 21 would love. Now, it's gonna take a little bit of work on your part because every man is a little bit different. I like some type of alcohol or something like that as a gift. So maybe Crown Royal or something like that. Some people like that Hennessy, maybe that White Hennessy, Grey Goose, whatever. Whatever your um, the male in your life, whatever his 
drink of choice is, I would say get him a big bottle of that. It's an inexpensive gift and you know they're going to love it because they drink it already. Now you just bought it for him, now you don't have to buy it. So that works out great. Also another thing that's really good, um, wine. So if you're male in your life, if they're wine drinkers, wine is another way, um, you know, having a really great gift as well. So don't don't go with the really, really cheap wine. Find a nice wine um, that would probably appeal to them. But again, that's gonna require a little work because it all depends on what type of wine they like. Do they like the sweet wine? Do they like the dry wine? So you wanna do a little bit of research on that. But it is a great, great, great gift. So just keep that in mind. So those are some things I think that are not very expensive. I think those are some things that will probably get your Christmas list taken care of for, for your men. Now, we're gonna go a little bit high end now. And we're gonna go a little bit high end. Now, that high end present is, if you can find it, you're gonna have to look high and low for it. Is that PlayStation 5? PlayStation 5 is a wonderful, wonderful gift. Now, the price point, again, it's kind of up there. It's gonna run you somewhere in the neighborhood of about $499. Now, $499, depending on your budget, may not be that much, but for some people, $500 for a gaming system is a big deal. Now, if the person that you're getting this for is an adult, then more than likely it's not really a big deal because $500 for an adult for a gift may not be that big of a deal. But for a, a child or something like that, I don't know. You may not want to spend $500 on that type of gift. But I'm gonna tell you, it is amazing. I don't have it yet, okay? But here's some of the things that really intrigue me about this product. Um, you're playing games in 4K and it has like a, a 120 hertz refresh rate. So the picture itself is gonna be gorgeous, right? So you put that on your big screen TV that you have currently, oh my gosh, it's gonna be amazing. Now, the other thing is the sound. So one thing about uh, entertainment equipment is the picture, but also the sound. So according to the article I was reading about it, they say that it has amazing quality sound. So uh, it's gonna it's gonna blow the roof off in your household if you have some surround sound speakers. They say that this thing is amazing. So PlayStation Five is definitely way to go. Now, <clears throat> some people, if you're if you're married or something like that, um, if you feel that you're sniffing others, then maybe a little bit too much time in front of the TV playing some video games. I will go to say, don't worry about that because it turns out that video games and playing challenging games helps with dementia, right? So if you don't want your man to get dementia, I'm just saying, get him a PlayStation 5. That way his mind can always be working, his mind can always be challenged, and that way he won't get dementia. I'm just saying, just a little health tip. I don't really know if that's true, but I'm just saying. It sounds good though, didn't it? Didn't it sound good? Yeah, I agree. I thought the sound cost awesome, so yeah, yeah. PlayStation 5. Let's talk about another perfect gift. You guessed it, boom, Meta Quest 2. Oh yeah, this is a awesome gift. Now this is the thing about this particular gift. I would say that anybody would enjoy this from young to old, it doesn't matter. The cool thing about this particular device, yes, it has games on it, no doubt about that. Also, you can watch movies on it as if you're in the movie theater and it gives you a real movie theater feel. But it goes a step further. So if you're like me, you love to travel. Love to travel. One of the things that we did, me and my wife, we took this Oculus or Meta Quest headset and we went to Paris in the headset. We loved it so much that we said we had to go to Paris. We in Paris, y'all. Paris. Paris. We, 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 we. <laughs> Last year, we took a trip together to Paris and it was amazing. And we had a preview in the Oculus or Meta Quest headset before we went. So anywhere, I'm not gonna say anywhere in the world, but a lot of the 
popular vacation destination you can visit in the VR headset and you have an idea of that destination before you book your flight. It is amazing. So this headset has multiple uses. So buy it for the now in your life, buy it for yourself. Just buy it, it's awesome. Time to get real personal, yo. Um, I don't even know how to start this. I've been married for 26 years. I got a fear of commitment. I know it sounds crazy. How can a guy that's been married since he was 20 years old have a fear of commitment? But I do. So I went to the only place I know to go anytime I have any major problem in my life. I went to my wife and I told her, I kept it real with her, I kept it straight with her. I said, look, for 40 years, 40 years, I have been trying and trying and trying to find my signature scent. Yes, I said it, my signature scent. Back in the day, my dad had Aramis. If y'all remember that scent, it was intoxicating. Amazing smell. However, I can't wear Aramis in 2023 or 2022. Can't do it. So I said, baby, what I'm gonna do? I can't find my signature scent. What she gonna do with it? What can I do? And she said, because she's a wise woman, she said, baby, you ain't gotta worry. You don't even have to commit. They have something called cologne variety packs. It comes in a pack of multiple different scents so I can smell a different way every day. I don't have to settle in one scent. I can be free, free to smell the way that I want to smell. Whew. That was a relief. So at Macy's, Bloomingdale, any of these, wonderful department stores, they have variety packs of various colognes from Dolce & Gabbana, Versace, Chanel. Find the scent that's for you. Get in a variety pack, and guess what? You can try different scents every day. Now, let's get back to the list. This one right here is a big one. Now, I know on Saturday, on Sunday, on Monday, on Thursday, you probably noticed that your man is probably sitting in front of at least a 55 inch TV watching some type of game. Now, I'm specifically talking about football games, but there are a lot of different types of games. Of course, NBA, NHL, whichever type of sport that your significant other or man in your life is into, I'm gonna tell you the best thing to do is go with some type of clothing or apparel or jersey or something like that, some type of hat, right? And a great place to go to get all of this cool apparel is probably something like uh, Fanatics or something like that. Um, the cool thing about Fanatics, you can they have like a free membership that you can take advantage of and they send you all types of emails and reference to discounts and stuff like that. So that is a wonderful place to go because no matter what type of fan your man is, Fanatics have the apparel product that will probably appeal to him because every man loves some type of cool jersey. Now, for those that know me, for those that know me, you know that I'm from GA, Cab County, born and raised. Yes, I'm that dude from Decatur. However, I've changed my stripes over the years. Y'all can judge me if y'all want to, I don't care, okay? Judge me if you want to. I know that right now, Georgia is on top. And I'm not saying I hate Georgia, but I'm just saying my love goes a little bit deeper. Deeper. Look at it. Look at it. Roll Tide. I don't care if they're not in the playoff, but it's Roll Tide all 
day, okay? Now, my wife is from Alabama. That kind of leads to partly why, you know what I'm saying, I'm roll tight. But you know what? Nah, son. I just like Nick Saban. I think that he is a awesome coach. And um, I'm gonna ride with that dude because he put together a really good program and he has groomed some really great players. Did you see Jalen Hurt? They talking about Jalen Hurt MVP. MVP. Did you see Tua? Matter of fact, we saw Tua when we went to Hawaii. He was on the parade float. Yeah. So anyway, my point is, yeah. So Alabama, they they really have a, a system that really grooms young men. So all I'm saying is, no matter what team that your man is into, get him some type of collegiate or NBA, NFL, something like that. They will really enjoy a pair. Now, speaking on the same vein as apparel and sports, another great present is some type of entertainment present, right? I like this present the most. So you can buy your man that's in your life, buy them, take it to a sport event, right? That would be something that would probably be huge, especially if you can get them some good seats. Oh, woo. That would be amazing. A playoff game? Oh, I'm just saying. That would be an amazing, amazing gift. So, apparel, but if you can get it, some type of entertainment, sporting event, that would be huge. Now, if your man that's in your life is not into sports, maybe he's into music. That's okay. Get him concert tickets. If he's not into music, maybe he's into TV or plays or something like that. Well, right now, New Jack City has a play that's touring right now. So maybe take us to New Jack City, the play. Uh, I think uh, Tretch is in there. Um, so it's getting really good reviews. So if that's something that you're into, check out something like that. There are so many different entertainment things that you can do with the man you're like. One of the things that I told my son that I want, um, I want to go to like one of those um, go-kart places where we can race go-karts. Um, I just think it'd be fun for me and my boys to do. And my, yeah, I know my kids are not really boys. They're, they're grown, 25 and 28. So they're grown. But I'm just saying, this is something fun that we can do. And it will be memorable. And I will always remember it. So that's something that you can keep in mind. Create an experience for the person in your life. Time to get cozy, y'all. If you notice, I woke up to a wonderful bottle of the Crown Royal Apple. Oh yeah, but it's not even about the Crown Royal. You know what it's about? It's about this wonderful plush robe. Oh my gosh, it is so cozy. So what you wanna do is get your man a super plush robe, okay? This particular role, uh, got this role from Ralph Lauren. I went with the dark color. They have like dark blue, they have white, I think they have black. Um, I would go with a dark color uh, because I'm gonna be honest with you, I do everything in my role. So the last thing you want is a dirty, off-white looking role because of all the dirty accumulation. So, saying the dirt don't show up so a nice plush robe is the way to go now if you get the nice plush robe the next thing you probably want to add to that list ooh, yeah some ugg slippers now these ugg slippers are super super comfortable and if you notice look at the bottom they have a nice sole on the bottom nice grip so this is something that you can wear around the house, but also maybe wear in the garage or something like that. Uh, maybe outside in the backyard if you gotta go out there and pick something up. Um, would you wear this to Walmart? No. Would you wear it to Publix? No. Have I? 
I would like to say, we'll just leave it at that. Like I say, don't worry about what I do. You do what you're supposed to do. Don't be doing what I do. I'm just saying, I'm crazy. I'm crazy. So, what I'm saying is, don't wear outside the house. Outside the house, there's a lot of germs and stuff like that. So you definitely don't wear outside the house. But if you do wear outside the house, um, they have some um, microband, 24 hours. Spray yourself down with that. Spray all your goods down with that. And like I say, then it'll kill all the coronavirus and all of that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that, that's a way to go. Think about that. So get some Ugg slippers. Now, it doesn't necessarily have to be Ugg slippers, but make sure there's some nice, comfy, plush slippers with fur in the inside. Um, I like the ones that has the, you know, heel, where you put your heel in there and everything. So I like that, but some people like the slip-on um, type slippers, where they can just slip them on, slip them on. But again, you want to go with a dark color because what you don't want is a tan or something like that and then you know you spill spaghetti on it now it's ruined right so um that's something that i recommend with the shoes uh, the house shoes and the roll go with a dark color all right so it's time for my favorite thing of the year uh, i know let's say as we go through this list you're going to see a lot of things that more appeals to you which is great but i found something that i think is amazing um my wife bought it for me for christmas this year but i snuck in i saw it and i said i i, I gotta i gotta have this now so she went ahead and let me have it now and uh, i'm just telling you i wear it all the time okay so here it is. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take it a little real slow. Boom, chicka chicka, boom. Alright. Yeah. Oh yeah. We talking about the onesie, baby. Yes, yes. With the hood. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying. Look at that. Mm. Look at it like this. Mm. Yeah. The onesie, I tell you right now, it has pockets. Look at that. Oh, 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 you talking about cozy, cozy, cozy within my skin, cozy. Oh, yeah, this is it right here. This is it. So, this is another, another one, as DJ Khaled may say, and another one. Yes, this is another great gift idea. Oh. Love it, love it, love it. So, get your onesie. Now, there's a lot of places that you can get a onesie. Um, this one right here came from Old Navy, but if you watch Rihanna's fashion show, you probably notice that she has an amazing underwear line. I looked on her site and she has a onesie there as well. So maybe you want some Fenty Savage or Savvy Vintage. Whatever, I'm just saying, check that out. But I'm just saying, this Old Navy get the job done. Very, very stylish. I love it so much. Even my dogs have the same outfit. We can dress alike. Yeah, that's right. I said my dogs have the same outfit. They be styling with Dion too. I'm just saying. So, here's another great gift. Thank you for tuning in to my channel, Styling with Dion. I want to give a shout out to Mr. Touch for commenting. I agree. That red coat was amazing. Hopefully my wife get that for me for Christmas. So if you want to continue to get all of this great Dion content, make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell, and also share with others so you can get the latest and greatest Dion content. And we're out. Now, I'm going to help you all with what men like, but if you can comment below about what women want, I have a slice idea. I'm running out of time. Help me.